far as the weather. Now locally, Debbie is not going to have much of an impact other than to help keep us very dry and hot in the coming days. You'll notice this morning we're starting off with good visibility. We've got cloud free skies across central Alabama too. I want to show you the next to seven days as we've got some very hot temperatures, temperatures that are a bit above average for this time of the year. The humidity is not going to be terribly bad, and so we're not going to see just days and days of heat advisories. Uh, we will see feels like temperatures a little bit above our actual high temperatures, so mid 90s is where we're headed today. And Debbie will actually provide us with a little bit of a breeze this afternoon, ranging from 10 to 20 miles an hour at times. Our feels like temperatures, there'll be enough humidity around though that it will create numbers close to 100, 101 in Hoover, 102 Calera, 101 in Tuscaloosa, Greensboro, 101 with upper 90s in the eastern spots. I think East Alabama will likely have a little more cloud cover thanks to Debbie, and there could even be a spotty shower or two around for our eastern counties, and then just hot and dry for the end of the week, low and mid 90s over the weekend. All right, thanks, Steph. The U.S. government